So now let's build a formatted message input where we can take in first and last name and return that to the user. So let's start with getting uh, the first name. And we're just going to get a variable. We're going to call that first. And we're going to get input for that. And we'll prompt the input to enter your first name. And then let's go ahead and run that code. So I'm going to put in Alton and enter that. And then I can print out the first name. And we see Alton. And notice that Alton is in lower case there. So I want to fix that by using the capitalize. So we see right there is the capitalized method that we learned. And we can format it that way. So let's run that code again. And now Alton should be formatted. The input will return a string that is entered in that uh, input box. And then it will apply that method to it and assign it to the variable first. And when we run that, now we see Alton is capitalized. So we could go ahead and go ahead and get the last name. And so we'll go through the same process and we'll ask it to enter your last name. And we're going to capitalize that. And even if I put it in lowercase, again, I should be able to get the first and last name. And so now let's go ahead and do first plus last name. And we know from last time that this is going to cause a little bit of a problem, but let's go ahead and run that. And we see that we need to add our space formatting in there. And I need a plus sign. And now we get the formatted Alton De Rosa with the first name and last name. And that's the way that we'll be able to get input using two different variables and then concatenating those variables in a print statement. And next, we'll learn how to put that into a function.